is Anything Can Happen Friday, the art and culture side of Southeast Asia. Hello and welcome back to Durian ASEAN. You're with Gauri. Good morning. This is Grace. And this is Anything Can Happen Friday on DurianASEAN.com. And today we have a guest in the studio, of course, who is、uh, going to share with us about her music. And her name is Mira. Let's say hello to her. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Hi. <laughs> How、hello. are you doing? I'm good. Very good. Thank you so much for joining us、uh, in the studio this morning. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> so, Mira, maybe a little introduction to yourself.、Uh, what do you do? Where are you from? How did you get here? No. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>、uh, uh, I'm a musician,、um, playing in a bar, in a restaurant,、um, with a band called M I R A.、Um, That's also Kamira. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So how did I get here?、Uh, as in, how did you get into <laughs> music? Not to the <laughs> studio. Okay, okay. <laughs>、uh, because、um, my dad is also he was a musician.、Mm, okay. He was a guitarist, so I've been like、uh, admire his uh, uh, his works. Yeah, his yeah. works from I was、uh, a kid, and then and I I tried I tried to to learn. Play guitar and、mm. try to sing, and then that's it. It I, happened. Yeah, it happened. So it since、happened. you were a kid, your your dad has been playing music,、yeah. and you were exposed to all that at a very young age. Yes. So、uh, Mira or M I R A is also the name of your band. Yes. And it stands for it stands the for other names of yeah, the band members. Yeah, the names are <coughs> like M is my name, Mira.、Mm-hmm. I is Izat, my guitarist. R is also my、uh, Rick. R is for Rick,、um, our drummer, and also we have another drummer called、okay. Purnama. It's like R also <laughs> <laughs> Purnama, and A uh, is uh, for my bassist called I. So、oh, right. that's kind of being M I R A. So how did you guys come together as a band? Did you know each other before? Were you uh, playing uh, together already? It's like a.、Mm, Me and、uh, my my basis, we were friends.、Mm-hmm. Uh, we were friends like our friends, friends like introduce the friends. So、okay. we get it together. <laughs> mutual friends. Yeah, yeah. mutual friends. <laughs> that's that's how it happened.、Uh, okay. <laughs> and what kind of music、uh, do you guys play? For M I R A, we 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 have all varieties from the oldies. Until、uh, all these retro,、mm-hmm. current, top forty. So we have a bit of this, a bit of that. And why? Why is that? Why didn't you guys choose to just focus on one thing? So,、um, so we ha- we can be more flexible. Okay. So we 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 like maybe we play in one place,、mm-hmm. so it can capture all kind of okay of、um, ages.、Uh. So when you go to different places,、yeah. you can play different music as、yeah. well. You don't have to tell them like, oh, I only play this kind of music,、yeah. or I can't do、That's、that. <laughs>、uh-huh. So、uh, about your band,、uh, how long have you guys been together? For M I R A, actually M I R A is、uh, it's, it's just like、uh, two months ago, but、mm-hmm. we've been together from the previous band for three years. Three years. Yeah. So this would be your third year or your fourth one. <laughs> fourth. This yeah, this is going、wow. into it's two thousand fifty. Yeah, fourth year. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 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 okay. But how is it like your journey so far?、Mm-hmm. Being in a band, playing outside for four years. <laughs> yeah, it's been like up and down, sad and happy.、Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then、uh, I believe you've changed your name also, right? Like、mm-hmm. for the band, it was something it was else, different. different. Yeah, yeah. yeah. different. It was、uh, magnifico,、uh, and then one on one of our band member taking a break, so we decided to change the name.、Mm-hmm. Uh, who were your influences or idols when it comes to music? Who gives you the the most inspiration? Do you mean in artist or singer? Yeah, yeah.、Mm. Um, for me, ah,、uh, for me myself,、mm-hmm. uh, I I listen a lot of ah.、Uh, m- More to jazz. More to jazz. Okay. So I've been listening to Frank Sinatra, Laura、oh, Fiji,、wow. and until now, uh, and but、uh, my my favorite now,、mm. uh, pop artist is、uh, Adele. Okay. Sia. So that's my. 
Is there、yeah. uh, one person that that you aspire to be like? Some. Like in for now for for um the new new generation,、mm-hmm. I would like to be like、uh, Ed Sheeran. Like Ed Sheeran.、Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because she doesn't care、mm-hmm. about his look, but he, right. The 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 the,、mm-hmm. the the music is matters. Do you do you feel like、uh, in the local music industry?、Uh, People tend to focus more on their music, or is it more on、uh, like their looks, their their fashion, or in terms of selling themselves as opposed to focusing、um, on their music? Do you mean in Malaysia? Yeah,、uh, Malaysia, yeah. yeah, Malaysia is. Uh, they they're not maybe n- maybe now maybe ten、mm-hmm. um, years that、uh, maybe in in ten years、uh, they will. Um, focus more to quality of music, but、mm. now our industry is not so big, so they they always look at the package. Right. Package is like look、uh, a bit of music, a bit、mm. of、uh, quality. So, so you need to have sort of like the complete、yeah. thing now. Complete package. Oh, it's difficult to <laughs> break into the. It's difficult <laughs> actually. <laughs> so,、uh, how old were you when you started playing or started getting into music? Serious、uh, in a、mm. serious、uh, s- pop scene. It was like ten years ago, eleven years ago. Okay. Because now I am at thirty-three years old. Okay. <laughs> no, you don't like <laughs> <it> like <laughs> it. <laughs> so it's like eleven、uh, years ago. Right.、Yeah. And what were the platforms that were available back then when you were starting out? Was it very <sighs> so difficult? Very I was like I struggling. Uh, because my、uh, especially my English, my English is not um. English is not my first language,、mm-hmm. I so I I have to struggle to like pick up all the all、uh-huh. the、um, English song. You know, it's so it's it was difficult. It was really、I、tough.、See. How did you how did you keep yourself going? What encouraged you?、Mm, friends, 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 and、um, and also family. My family. Uh, always there for me.、Mm-hmm. Whatever I do, they're always there. So、yeah. whatever you do is is also kind of for them. Yeah. <laughs> You're getting a little <laughs> emotional. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so、uh, are you guys、uh, planning to release an album soon? A single? Yeah. We're planning to release an album soon. I hope this year. Uh huh. So, for me, it's like.、Uh, It's not an easy thing to to do、uh, original song for me. It's、okay. m- waiting waiting for my <laughs> creative mind.、Mm. So, <laughs> but I'm still waiting lah、uh, with my、right. my my song. <laughs> so、uh, hopefully it will be yeah, out soon. Yeah, hopefully. And、uh, I also want to know, being、uh, in the band itself, how has it、uh, changed you as a person、uh, from when you started out? Uh, back in two thousand, sorry, two thousand three, was it? Did you say? Two thousand three, yeah, two thousand. No. And she's calculating again. Two thousand four, two thousand four, right?、Uh, like uh, yeah, two thousand three, yeah. 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 So yeah, from back then until now, how how has it changed you as as a person? Um, back then, uh, I was like one of the band member. Um,、mm-hmm. like now, I'm a I'm a leader, band、okay. leader. So, uh, back then, I'm not uh. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking about anyone else. I'm just thinking、mm. about, about myself. But now, when when now I am a band leader, I have to think about all of my band members. Of course. So I have really, really big responsibility because、mm-hmm. my like my 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 guitarist, he has five kids. My my bassist, he,、uh, he has four kids. So that's、mm. a really, really big responsibility for me、mm. to keep the quality, the band quality. Is it is it hard to do? <laughs> It's hard, <laughs> very hard. Because a lot of people, I、mm-hmm. mean, in the in the band, so many commitments. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And、uh, going back to、uh, your journey itself. Uh, besides、uh, taking care of your band members and all, obviously you've also learned a lot and and grown a lot as a person.、Yeah. So,、uh, what's like maybe the best advice anyone has given you, or the most important lesson that you've learned along the way? Very important lesson. <laughs> I was a shy kind of person,、okay. really, really shy. Okay. I I didn't talk. I I um wasn't talk to people. 
and then until one point mm. i have to do it because this is my this is mm. my 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 rice bowl oh, i'm right. I'm, oh. a, i'm a entertainer i'm a singer okay. so i have to talk to people i have to do a pr and all yeah. so i have to do it and then it changed myself it okay. changed myself to more brave to talk to people yeah And uh, where do you see uh, the band going? Let's just say in like the next five years or so. Mm, if the, uh, yep, if the plan, the planning mm-hmm. uh, for the the album is really uh, go goes well, so uh, we need to like go all out with the okay with the. So talking um, about all out, yeah. <laughs> do you also plan to play outside of Malaysia? Yeah. So have you played outside of Malaysia before, <laughs> or is it? Uh, <laughs> are you also in the one of the, your plan mm. uh, planning yeah, for your I, band? Yeah, it's one of my planning, but this band not yet. All right. Okay. Not yet. <laughs> oh, not yet. So if you you were given a choice uh, to to travel and a tour around uh, around the world, which country would you choose for your band to go there and uh, perform? Uh, I'm not not gonna go too far. Uh, Perhaps like Southeast Asia. Yeah, Southeast reason. Asia, yeah. like uh, Indonesia and Philippines. They they got a lot of like mm-hmm. really really fantastic musicians. Of course, so yeah. I, I would Have like to. Have you uh, been to those countries and? Yeah, I, I've I've mm. been to uh, Manila. Okay. I've been like uh, I've seen the band there. They were. So mm. awesome! <laughs> it's like it's their, it's in their soul, you know, yeah. when they sing. <laughs> <laughs> But so you don't have uh, any other job, is it? You're trying to. I'm also, uh, I'm also a teacher uh, okay. in the daytime. Uh, I'm a vocal teacher for kids. Right. Yeah. Oh, can I be considered <laughs> <laughs> a <local> no. vocal <laughs> lesson? <laughs> So, uh, so, so apart from that, you're trying to go uh, music full time yeah. and and pursue this as a career, and that's uh, something that's very brave as well because <laughs> for sure a lot of people uh, tend to have uh, a day job and uh, they're not willing to risk uh, everything, mm-hmm. uh, especially in Malaysia itself. Uh, it's I guess there's, there's not that much support uh, from from the parties that are involved. Yeah. Uh, what about in terms of uh, funding for 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 your band, for your gigs, for your hmm funding? Yeah, <laughs> funding. Um, Is it mainly from the performances mm-hmm. gig, or do you have any like you know any uh, organization that has been helping? <laughs> your band? No. Not yet. No, no. it's from our gig. If we if we like we receive like uh, inquiries for wedding or private function, I see. Th- we will make a bit extra money mm-hmm. there. Uh, uh, is there anything uh, about the local industry that you wish would change, or anything that that you hope? Yeah, like like we 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 discussed just now. Mm-hmm. I hope our industry, Malaysian industry, yeah. it's more than package. Oh. It's more than package. Okay. It's more to quality. So uh, don't always go for the the looks, the yeah. fashion. And all. <laughs> Sometimes quality music can come uh, of without all that uh, yeah. glamorous uh, front. What about uh, in terms of support? Do you feel like the uh, government or our Ministry of Arts and Culture is uh, giving support or providing platforms for our local artists? Uh, yeah, like um, we have uh, we have like a a, a lot of. All kind of reality TV mm-hmm. that we have in Malaysia, but I think still they they look for package. <laughs> 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 okay, so uh, you want to you wish that Malaysians could just do away with this like yeah. package mentality yeah. and yeah. explore more music, explore more bands yeah. and all. Uh, So, uh, what are some of the venues that that you guys play at? Yep, uh, every Thursday. Uh, We will be at Desi Sri Hartamas, the mm-hmm. the restaurant called Chapter One. Uh, every Saturday, uh, Waikiki Bar PJ, and every Sunday, uh, Tom Dick and Harry Pavilion. Yeah, mm-hmm. only that. And these are your regu- regular um, regular for January. Yes. It it will it will change uh, according to uh, contracts and all. Okay, mm. okay. 
And uh, apart from that, uh, one of the reasons why you're here today is because you are also part of the yeah. flood relief that TDH yeah. is organizing. And Ooh. also that's very meaningful and then uh, it will be a memorable event for all the musicians as well as, well as the audience as well. Yeah. yeah. So you want to tell us a bit about, about that, how you got involved uh, with this yeah. project? Um, because like... Um, the the one of the owner one of the owner uh, Mr Ernest uh, mm-hmm. uh, we've been playing at Tom Dick and Harry P- Pavilion it was almost like two years mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. Well, we we know each other then when when we heard about this uh, project and we just discussed like why not mm-hmm. that uh, maybe we can do something there. Yeah. Well, oh, that's really uh, nice of you to, you know, as, as just say uh, yes without second thought, <laughs> because actually nowadays a lot of people give a second thought. Uh, I mean, mm-hmm. uh, a lot of people. I mean, uh, musicians because it comes with the payment, and then yeah. what they what they play, they they deserve to be paid. But then for this event, it's just uh, uh, they just go full on because of the, the the motive behind of this event. Yeah, and what about? Uh, this this project when when you first heard about it and you knew about it and of course you agreed to perform uh, but what do you wish uh, would be the outcome of this this whole project? I hope like um um I hope other bands mm-hmm. or other musicians will follow what what we be doing okay. now. Okay. So we give support. We give what we can. Of course, we don't have enough money to mm-hmm. give to to give to the mm-hmm. uh, flight victims. But this is what we we really, really can do it. Yeah. Right. So you you have your music. And yeah, you're music. Using yeah. Using we'll use use our our talent to help people. Okay. That's the thing. That's the thing of uh, <laughs> uh, uh, being a uh, musician, and we can take advantage of our own <laughs> skills <laughs> to attract more people. <laughs> and actually, Grace, you're a part of the uh, flood relief effort as well. Yes, yes. I was you're actually expecting that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be performing. I was just kidding. Yeah, I'm also uh, my band Fast is also part of this event, and we are really grateful and also honored to be a uh, part of this event to be able to bring audience and also people to you know raise the awareness of what's been happening in Malaysia after all this natural disaster, the flooding that we are talking about mm-hmm. here. And then, well, we are musicians after all, and a lot, a lot of people can think, it, oh, what can musicians do, you know, right. to help out all those victims of flood? Probably However, go there and play some songs. Yeah, <laughs> but to entertain them, that right. could be one of them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but then we'll be entertaining here in KL at the TDH and to um, make sure that people do come to our show and that they can donate their funds for mm-hmm. these victims of the flood. So people just have to show up watch the gig and mm-hmm. make whatever contributions they can. And it's in fact, this event is held for a week. For yeah. a week. Yeah. So just to make sure you can choose and mm-hmm. pick your favorite musicians uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> to come and watch the show because there are quite uh, well-known musicians uh, so in this event as well. it's a week well. like uh, Monday to... All the way to Saturday. Monday Saturday. to Saturday. And every day there is a different band different performing, band. Yeah, and yeah. it's not just one, right? Uh, just not one. I think there are uh, around seven and eight bands all together, mm-hmm. and then they'll be playing, of course, their own uh, original tunes as well as cover, yeah. and then uh, to be able to share, you know, our tunes with our audience as well. And uh, Mira, I want to ask you more uh, about your band because uh, we didn't really talk about the other uh, three people. Uh, mm-hmm. What what do they do? Do they are they pursuing music full time as well? Do they have um, other jobs? Yeah, uh, they have other jobs. My, like right. my basis, uh, I he, he work uh, daytime, the daytime, and my guitarist. Um, <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> what does doing he do? In, like um, online online uh, business. Yeah. Okay. Okay. He's doing that, and my 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 other. Other, uh, a uh, drama Purnama is f- work in the daytime. Yeah. So they also have their own commitment when yeah. it comes to daytime job. Yeah. So, uh, do you think it's actually possible for local musicians to just go for music uh, altogether without having any other jobs? Can, but it's it's difficult. It's difficult. It's difficult. It's hard, but can. <laughs> Maybe well, if, uh, for the first few years, mm-hmm. you have to like struggle a right. bit, 
But after that, when you get uh, uh, more comfortable, mm -hmm. you will be okay. Well, let's revert the question to you, Gauri. Why? <laughs> Why? Because you've been uh, listening to local music yeah, so far, yeah. and then you will have uh, your own idea about mm -hmm. the, uh, our local musicians here. So what's your view? As in, like, do you think we can survive just being full-time musicians? Mm -hmm. uh, actually, it is uh, possible, I would say, because uh, it's, it's more about the mentality mm -hmm. of uh, people when you ask them about local music. They usually have this impression that uh, of local course. music can yeah. is there's no way it's as good as international mm. music and also mainstream. Uh huh. Yeah. Mainstream music. But if they actually take the time to uh, invest uh, in the singles or albums, they will realize that it's actually just as good. And there are times when you hear a song on the radio and you cannot tell the difference whether this is a local uh, song uh, yeah. or it's an international song because uh, we're getting there. We're already on par with all yeah. the uh, international artists. So uh, I think it's more about the awareness, which is why uh, even here in Duran ASEAN, we're trying to play uh, local music as much as possible because we want, uh, to want people to get exposed to it and uh, realize that the music is just as good. Like you can't even tell the difference. It's usually when you have that that bias already, and then you listen to it, and then you have the feeling like, yeah, I, I guess it's okay, but it's it's not really that good. Perhaps we should hire Gaudi <laughs> to become a spokesman yeah. on behalf of musicians. <laughs> so I give a big round of applause. <laughs> Thank you. So, uh, Mira, uh, before we wrap uh, things up this morning, is there any message that you want to get to all the Malaysians out there? Anything you want to say? Mm -hmm. Yeah, for the yeah for the all the musicians, don't ever give up. Just try and try and try. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, where can they learn more about your band? Just if upcoming wanna, gigs. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, just subscribe to our. Uh, Facebook, uh, Facebook dot com slash Mira Ben M Y. Right. Yeah. So, uh, thank you so much, Mira, for coming in today and sharing uh, thank you. your thank you, uh, thank yeah you. background, your experiences with us. And I hope to see you uh, at the event. Yeah. Yes. And hopefully, yes. the flood relief event uh, also becomes a success, and uh, you guys can. Uh, uh, help to give back to the Flood Victims uh, through your music. Yep. So uh, thank you very much. We'll be thank back uh, on Monday with our usual program.